Good morning, good morning, good morning. Um, this is part two of um, the thing I started last week. I just had the idea to do this and I think it's probably quite cool. So last week I played a very simple lick. Just single holes. What I'm going to do this week is I'm going to play the same thing, except I am going to, well, I'm going to play the same lick as my main lick, but I'm going to embellish it with some of the uh, techniques that are available to us as blues harmonica players to make this sound more exciting, fuller, more emotional, more expressive, hopefully. Um, and I haven't got a roadmap for this, so I'm just kind of going to dive in. And I think what I'll probably do is just maybe put captions up to s say what technique I'm doing at any uh, given point. Um, all of these, I have got videos, they're quite old now, but they're linked down below that describe all these techniques. And I've got PDFs that um, d describe them all as well. So hopefully this will sort of demonstrate how you can start off with something very straightforward and simple and um, using blues harmonica techniques turn it into something a bit more exciting and special um, so C harmonica uh, back in track in G same as last time did I play the lick already that's the plain lick here we go Wrong note.
Cutlass. Let's bring this to a close. Well, that was interesting, um, I suppose. Um, probably could have gone a bit better if I'd planned it out, but hey, um, that's life, isn't it? Hope you enjoyed. See you next time.